Maibam Manoj Kumar Session Judge Imphal is today convicted Kathrimium Bizu Elias Holendro, son of Ibungo of Irilbung, Tongkong and Toizum Tesis Elias Aboy Elias James, son of T. Jugindro of Tambalkong Sabalika in Ningobam Satyabhama murder case. They were convicted under Section 302 and 120B IPC. Satyabhama, a junior research fellow of RIMS Pathology Department, was murdered on April 2013. A bomb explosion took place in the wee hours today at Nongmaibung Seram Lerok in Imphalis under Porompat Police Station, but it did not cause any casualty. The explosion took place at the residence of Sashi Kumar, aged 59 years, son of S. Angoba, around 4.18 am. According to police reports, the house was partially damaged in the explosion. Sashi Kumar is a forest officer posted at Forest Range Chandel Division. Sasi Kumar disclosed that he recently received a monetary demand note from KCP Noyon faction. A team of Imphal West Police Commando led by DSP Operations verified people along Nagamapal Road stretch in Imphal City this morning. The police verified around 90 individuals and among them, five were detained for failing to produce proper documents, police said. They were handed over to City Police Station. India reported 27,071 fresh coronavirus infections in the past 24 hours, 10.5 percent less than the previous day, with the overall number touching 98.84 lakh according to Health Ministry data released this morning. In the 24-hour period, India reported 336 deaths linked to the virus, taking the total number of fatalities to 1 lakh 43,355. The central government may not procure Pfizer BioNTech's coronavirus vaccine, which is 95% effective in preventing the COVID-19 infection over its high cost for the immunization drive in India. Officials have indicated that India may not prefer Pfizer's coronavirus vaccine over the other options available in the country for the prevention of COVID-19, a media report said. Hairo constituency MLA Dr. Thokchom Radhishyam today said that ignorance of God leads to serious breakdown of discipline. He said that one should have respect for religion and that everyone has religious and spiritual beliefs. MLA TH Radhishyam was inaugurating a newly constructed temple at Ngarot Hill under Hairo Part 3 today. In a joint operation carried out by Assam Rifles and Nagaland Police, an NSCN Kangu Kadar was nabbed in Dimapur district recently. This has been revealed by the Assam Rifles in a tweet. The Assam Rifles informed that during the joint operation, they were able to recover arms and ammunition from the NSCN Kango Kader. The militant Kader has been actively working for the Kango fraction of the NSCN, the Assam Rifles claim. Assam Governor Jagdish Mukhi has accepted the claim of the elected members of United People's Party Liberal UPPL, Bharatiya Janata Party and Ganeshuraksha Party to form a new Executive Council of Borland Territorial Council BTC. As the farmers' protest completes nearly three weeks at the border of Delhi against the center's new farm laws, the farmers will observe a day-long hunger strike today. The hunger strike from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. is part of the farmers' plan to intensify their agitation from today. 21 days after violence at Pani Sagar in Tripura's Kanchanpur, Chief Minister Biplab Dev gave away compensation announced to the family of Bishwajit Dev Burma, who was killed in the violence. According to media reports, Chief Minister Biplab Dev gave the financial assistance while paying a visit to the victim's family. He also visited the residence of deceased Sri Kant Das at Das Da in Kanchanpur. Chief Minister Biplav handed over Rs 5 lakh check to each of the families of the deceased persons. India is now aiming to surpass China in the field of mobile manufacturing with the production link incentive PLI scheme attracting global measures in this segment to the country, Telecom and IT Minister Ravi Shankar Prasad said today. According to media reports, he said that the government is looking to make India a hub of other electronic products as well with expansion of the PLI scheme to other sectors.